Hi, in this lesson we will talk about one of the security mechanisms of DHCP, DHCP snooping. Here we will use the topology on the screen and in our topology we have one router, one switch and five PCs. Here, router 1 will be our uh, DHCP server, so let's start to configure it. On router 1, uh, firstly, uh, we will configure uh, first Ethernet 00, zero and we will assign IP address to this interface. And now shut down here. And uh, secondly, we will uh, create our DC people. X Y Z our uh, DC people name here. And we will give the pool IP addresses. Now let's save our configuration. Now let's configure our uh, PCs. Uh, as you know, they all get uh, automatically the IP addresses uh, from the CPU server. Yes. I think only here is enough for this example. And as you can see, it's getting my paralysis. And yes. Now it's time to uh, configure the key configuration of uh, this lesson, the CP snooping. We'll uh, do this uh, on our switch. We'll use IP DCP snooping command here. We have enabled the uh, CP snooping with this command. On our switch, uh, we will assign uh, Profess Ethernet 01 uh, as transport for DHCP snooping because uh, we are connected to our DHCP server and uh, it's a trusted server for us. For this, we will go to interface Fast Ethernet 01 and uh, we will say IP DHCP snooping trust. Yes, now uh, we have configured this uh, port as a trusted port, so uh, any DHCP uh, message coming from this DHCP server uh, will not be blocked and uh, the other ports are uh, not trusted ports uh, by default because uh, if a malicious uh, attacker uh, connect to this PC and uh, he can try to send uh, DHCP packets here uh, but if, when we configure uh, the DHCP snooping on our switch uh, these packets are blocked and uh, the attacker cannot achieve uh, to become our new DHCP server Attackers can uh, use different methods for uh, DCP. For example, uh, they can try to exhaust our uh, DCP pool IP addresses. So, uh, as an additional uh, security method, we can uh, configure another parameter here. Let's check our parameters, and here we will use limit. 
uh, for example, we can use 10. With this IPDCP snooping limit 10 command, we will uh, limit our uh, coming uh, DCP requests in one second uh, with 10. Only 10 uh, DCP requests uh, will come to our uh, DCP server through this port anymore. Oh, let's uh, write this. Yes, we will use right. With this simple DCP snooping example, we have secured our network towards any attackers, any DCP attackers, and any rogue DCP servers.